Well, hello, fishing friends, and if you're new here, welcome. Thought I'd take today to look around and enjoy the sunset. <laughs> well, today what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk to you about boats. That's right. Got my boat over there, my nice sailboat, and I'm going to tell you everything there is to know about how to get your boats and how to use your boats. So first thing you need to know is you cannot drive your boats around. Your boats are just static. And that's because they don't allow you to drive boats. For one, this is a, a static background. Basically, it's a picture. So if you was to try to drive your boat closer to it, it would be all disordered and everything else. And so since they use a picture, it's kind of hard to move around. It's not like it's a, a digital image where they can change it out there. So that's probably one of the reasons why they don't let you drive around. Um, and I'm sure they have other reasons. But for now, there's no driving of the boats. So let's go in and talk about how you get the different boats. And we'll go ahead and go inside here. And we're going to go up to the board here. And there's different ways. You can earn some boats and you can buy some boats. So let's look at the ones that you can buy. So we go to the store here. You go down here to boats. And you have your freshwater boats. You start off with a wooden boat for freshwater. And for salt water, you do start off with a fishing boat. Those are free. You don't have to buy them. You unlock those when you get to the locations that require a boat. All right. So if we go to the freshwater, the first one you could buy is a Kynak for $2,000. And then you have your inflatable boat for $4,000. And then your motorboat for $6,000. So you buy those four boats. And then you go to your salt water. Salt water, like I said, you start off with this fishing boat. The next one you can get is a speedboat. That's $10,000. And then you get a double motor boat. It's kind of a bigger version of the speedboat. And then last, you buy the sailboat for $50,000. Now, what happens when you buy all eight of those boats? Well, you earn... Let's come over here. The Nautilus submarine. Yep. So if you've seen people out on a submarine, that's how they got that submarine, is you have to buy... All, well, I guess you would buy six boats because you are given two of them. So you would buy the six boats in the store there. That unlocks the Nautilus submarine. Now, if you have the U.S. West DLC, you can also unlock two more boats. That here, over here is the Hoangpo sailboat. I don't know if I said that right. But that's when you catch a lot of fish when you're float fishing. And I want to say it was 300 uh, but I'm not positive. But I, I, I think it's, it was around 300. And then next to that one, you get a pontoon boat. And you catch that one, catching a lot of fish while lure fishing. All right. So those get unlocked with the U.S. West DLC. Now, now that you've purchased those boats, how do you use it? Okay. So if you purchased it and you jump on a, a lake or something and you're like, you're back in your same wooden Robo. You, you don't have your boat that you just purchased. How do you use it? Well, here's the simple way to do it. What you do is you go out here, you go out the door, and there's going to be a kiosk right here. At this kiosk is where you're going to select your boats. So you have your pontoon boat for your freshwater, your motor boat, and you can see them changing over here. Inflatable boat, your kayak, and then your wooden, your little wooden boat. Now you got your wooden boat there. You want to change the color. You can change it to orange or yellow. Or green for St. Patrick's Day. Happy St. Patrick's Day. That's today. <laughs> or you can go over here to your salt water. Your salt water you have. This is the, you know, the sailboat. This is the one I like to use a lot. I do have my submarine. Of course, I got a yellow submarine. Big Beatles fan. Then you have your Huangpo sailboat. That one's kind of neat. It's very large. And then, let's see here. Where's my other boat? Was it in a... There it is. Pontoon boat. Oh, that's right. It's freshwater. So you got your freshwater pontoon boat. And there you go. You can stand on it over here and, you know, play around like you're driving it and waving at the people. <laughs> so, but there you go. So that's how you change your boats. And then when you go to a location, um, either freshwater or saltwater that requires a boat, um, you'll be on that boat. So I'm going to go ahead and change my boat. My color to, I like to use that yellow color for my pontoon boat. It's kind of neat. Um, and you will be on that boat. 
me get back to my sailboat here so that I'm on it when I go to my uh, saltwater location. So if we go to a saltwater location, let's say location 20 of South Korea, where you have to be on a boat. Here I am on my boat. And there's my boat. So that is how you use, that's how you get and use your boats. So hopefully this helps you if you've been confused about your boats. There you go. There's a quick tip on how to use and uh, purchase your boats. So hopefully this helps you. If it did, give me a great big thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button so you can see more tips and tricks like this in the future. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.